Oh my gosh. Wait, can I blow that up? Never mind. That thing wants to kill me. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the Quintiverse. My name is Quinn and welcome back to another edition of The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. So, in the last video, um, we actually got to the Earth Temple. We got to the Earth Temple and now, um, it seems like we have to climb- Whoa! I forgot about this. It's actually been a hot minute since I played this game. So, we are continuing on in the Earth Temple and, oh my gosh, man. That's a beautiful view. Okay, so um, it's a brand new year, and right now we are ready to take the Quintiverse on the road. Oh, something about to happen. Wait. A chest in the middle of everything. What could it be? Whew, we got the dragon sculpture. This is a carving of salt, soiled dragon made out of dazzling gold. I find it kind of funny how um, this looks. This sounds like it. This looks like it's supposed to be booby trapped. Is this booby trapped? I did not. I I promise you guys, I did not know this was gonna happen. I did not know this was gonna happen. I just assumed so because of the music and how. Oh. I just assume so because of the music and how um, that ramp was structured. So it looks like that that ramp was structured for something to roll down there. So I just assumed and I was right. Uh. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh. Okay. Oh, oh, I know. Okay, I think I know where it goes. Uh, I'm trying my best to control these. I, I think I got it, but the other way around, right? No, it's supposed to. Okay, I'm confused. Okay. Oh, okay. So I found. So, it's supposed to something go like this, but I'm supposed to turn it around. Okay. Let's see if I got it this time. Let's see if I got it this time. Gotcha. Okay, okay, that was... That took longer than I wanted it to, but it's, it's cool. It's cool. Alright, check in the recording and make sure everything is working good. It is working A-okay. I hope you guys are... I hope you guys are enjoying the new year, I really do, you know, um, oh my gosh, something's about to go down, something's about to go down. Link, okay, so, the door just got shut, wait. Oh, I thought that's what Fee wanted to tell me. Can I get out my sword and use a dowsing skill? Oh my gosh, it's that boulder that chased me. He swallowed it. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Okay, uh, how do you, uh, okay, like that. Okay, you can store 10 at the most. Uh, I'm storing 10. Because I know something's about to go down. Master, I detect Zelda's aura in the surrounding area. I detect an especially strong reaction from the change. I calculate pro the probability Zelda was bound to it. Okay. I surmise Zelda was somehow able to escape and proceed along this past the session weekend. Zelda's fast. I gotta admit that. I'm the one with the sword and the destined hero of legend. Yet she honestly got through all that faster than I could. Something's about to roll down here. <laughs> oh my god, it's him. Gear of him. Oh, it's you. Let me see. No, that's not it. This is so very embarrassing. But I seem to be at loss for your name. 
Not that it matters, really. To tell you the truth, I feel a bit frustrated and right now I need someone to vent to. I heard many- I heard my underlings and have finally captured the Spirit Maiden, so of course I rushed over here. What can I say? I was excited. Flustered, even. But what did I find when I arrived? That agent of the goddess. She had once again. You see, what I am trying to say is... That goddess serving dog escaped with the girl! I must have that spirit maiden in order to resurrect my master! I must have her! I got a little carried away there, didn't I? I don't deal with, well, complications to plans I've laid out so carefully. It's a character flaw of mine. <laughs> ah, but something good can still come of this day. I had all this bottled up anger smoldering inside of me, and now I can release it. There's something, there's someone special I'd like you to meet. Oh, don't be shy. I need to vent all of this unhealthy anger, and your agony is such great stress reliever. It won't take more than a few moments with my friend before you're charred to a satisfying crisp. And let me tell you, that will put a spring in my step. So he's trying to fry me! Oh my gosh. Wait, can I blow that up? Never mind. That thing wants to kill me. Ah! Okay, okay, wait, wait, how do you get out your- Oh jeez, 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 oh I'll take these. But the bum bum bum, but the bum bum bum, but the bum bum So am I, okay, so am I, um, beating it? I think it automatic I think that bomb automatically blew it up. What? Oh, uh oh. Oh, I'm supposed to wait, no. Wait, what? What did it blow up? What am I supposed to do? Do I just keep throwing bombs at it? Okay, now I know what I'm supposed to do. I messed up that, I messed up that badly.
Oh, I could have blown it up right there. Oh, jeez. Okay, I can just let it get blown up by those things. Whoa! Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. No! Crap. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Whoa. What? Unbelievable. Go! I got four more bombs left, come on. Seriously? He was almost dead. Come on. Come on. I'm ready for you. I was ready for this. Come on. Yeah! what I'm talking about, baby! That is what I'm talking about! And I got it all on camera, baby! Got it all on camera, baby! Ooh! La, 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 la. It looks like we got a heart container. We got a heart container. Your life increased by one and now it's fully replenished. Okay, guys, looks like we can go all the way up. So let's go, Link. Come on. Up to, 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 rest. Up to, up to, up to, up to, wait. I'm replenishing my bomb count. That's what I'm doing. You know, I didn't even have to use any of these hearts, which is amazing. I remember the last boss fight with Gearham. I had to use all of my hearts. All of the hearts they laid out for me just to survive. So, are we going to see Zelda behind the door? I highly doubt it. <gasps> Is that Zelda? Oh my gosh. Wait, what? We just found Zelda, y'all! I just said... <sighs> Quentin!
You cannot go to him. Your grace, remember what we discussed. Restrain yourself. Focus on the task at hand. Please don't tell me you're going to take on Gary him by yourself. I I have to go. I'm sorry, Quinn. I came all the way for you. It's literally got bolted by a mountain. Bold, got hit by boulders on mountains. O almost burned myself in a volcano. And now I almost got crushed by a giant ball rock monster. And she says, no. <laughs> who, who are you? Man, I got a sword, man. I got the goddess sword. Don't give me even it. It took you far long, far too long to get here. Looking at you, I fear the goddess is mistaken her choice of agents. If this failure is in any indication, you have no hope of defending her grace from those who seek her sailor. Mm -hmm. Is he saying that I'm not worthy to protect Zelda? Do my words anger you, boy? Do my words sing? Let them. If I had not come when I did, your Zelda would have already fallen into the hands of the enemy. The truth of it is you were late. You were late and you failed to protect her. I sent Zelda ahead to learn more of the fate in which she is destined to play a part of. Listen well, chosen one. If you wish to be a help to her grace, you must summon a shred of courage and face the trials laid out before you. Only when you've conquered the trials will you be of use to Zelda. No sooner. Am I understood? This guy later said, I'm not worthy. Did you not just see me take on that lava monster, bro? Did you not just see me take on that lava monster? Link is angry right now. That He, he is angry. Well, we might as well. Um, is there anything to collect here? Um, I suppose not. So we might as well like that uh, statuette right there, or stat like that statue right there. Uh, Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to translate for you. From the edge of time, I guide you, the one destined to carry out the goddess's mission. The spirit maiden who descended from the clouds has passed through the earth's spring and made her way to a fated place. This music, man. The parched desert of Lanaru that is where the chosen will pass through the gate of time into a distant world. So we just got another tablet, so that's good. We just got another tablet, so which means we. The Amber Tablet. Which means we are finished with the Earth Temple. The weather surface of the test zone feel very old. Okay. <laughs> Poor Link. Oh, we are out of here. He just walked through the entire. Uh, you know, we could have just used one of these in the side temple, but um, I'm not saving. I'm not saving and quitting this time, and I'm not ending the video. I'm just saving. So let us save right here. Um, now that we have the uh, places, I'm gonna go to the sky. The sky. My bad. Let's try that again. We're going to. The sky. Whee! Come to me, my bird friend.
Okay, so we must go to Skyloft. Up, up, and away! wondering how the heck do I get up hey. oh Quentin how's it going any luck tracking down Zelda I see well we're all pulling for you by the way I saw Krokeel's mother heading up towards the temple a little while ago she looks pretty upset why don't you suppose something happened to you uh -huh. Krokeel's gone missing we gotta do something I'll start looking to I'll ask around and see if we we'll oh yeah I might. I'm gonna figure out how to go to the side missions um, soon. Um. First, I'm gonna do this, and I can try. I'll try to find uh, Kukra. So, first inside the statue of Goddess, so we can put another piece on. Oh, I completed the pieces. Woo! Okay. So, the statue just pointed to another land I need to explore. I've confirmed the location of the third opening of the cloud barrier's sky. It will allow us to retrieve the lunar surface. I said just go in there as soon as possible? Okay. Well, before we go there, I have 300 rupees because that's literally my limit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a couple things in Skyloft. Um, I'm going to find uh, Kukil's... I believe that's how you pronounce it. I'm going to try to find Kukil or at least try to find some clues. And I'm going to go shopping, so... I'm gonna just cut I'm just gonna kind of cut back and forth when it comes to it you know so we're here um... it's cookie so what Kukil's missing she was abducted by a monster you don't think this has anything to do with those silly stories about a horrifying monster that's been living here in Scalafrage, huh? Horrifying monster that's been- wait, people say that creature is dead, I even scared what should have Okay, so horrifying monster, wasn't that at the same place that they took my, uh... Where's Kukuil? Kukuil? I did see her playing over in the graveyard yesterday. My mom called me home, so I left. The graveyard. Okay, is there a map I can pull up? Uh, light tower, plaza, house, the bazaar, night academy, sparring hall, statue of the goddess. What graveyard? Hmm. You know, I'm gonna keep talking to people and see if I can get some clues, you know, and then I'll see if I figure out where Kukil is. Did you hear a child who's been playing in a graveyard went missing yesterday? Can you believe it? I really don't. I really. Do you really think there are monsters abducting children all the time? Uh, I don't know. Nothing phase you, does it? Nothing phase you, does it? Challenge your fans from our little children. <laughs> Uh, I do. Huh? I do think there's a chance she would drag off a monster. Oh, there was, there's an old man who lives near here who always rants about hidden monsters here in Skyloft. Everyone knows he's a little loony though, so don't so no one take him seriously. You want to know where the old man is? I imagine he's at the Lumpy Pumpkin. Okay, I know where that is. So I'm gonna make my way towards the Lumpy the Lumpy Pumpkin and hopefully pick up some of that good um, pumpkin drink. I forgot how to go! Huh, okay. 
I'll meet you guys there. Okay. Okay, everybody. So we are at the Lumpy Pumpkin just about. Woo! Fire in the hole. Yeah, baby. Okay. So we are at the Lumpy Pumpkin. At least that's what I think it's called, you know? Let's make sure. Okay, we are at the Lumpy Pumpkin. So this is the old. Yeah, I remember you. You're that old man. You might ha you have that couple look on your face that says that says you might take an old ram old man ramble seriously. Do you believe it's Kyle? Shouldn't even I shouldn't even call that monster. It's a demon. I'll tell you, but no one say for sure because no one's seen it and live tell tell. What you wanna know how come and sell it? Yeah. Yes, yes. Well, I saw, it, but I was able to escape by the seat of my pants. I was saved by my cat like reflexes. Any regular person would have lived, wouldn't have have lived long enough to scream. Anyway, I saw that thing, I tell ya. There's a great big tree in the cemetery. I walked by the tree in the middle of the night. And... I saw it hit the gravestone... I saw it hit the gravestone nearest the tree. So you walked in the cemetery in the middle of the night and you saw it hit a gravestone near the tree. And the gravestone lit up. It pushed the gravestone... And the door to the storage shed opened all by itself. The monster then went into the shed, then it looked behind itself, which was expect unexpectedly polite for a demon. It was the most terrifying thing in these old eyes I've seen. If you're smart, you stay clear of the cemetery in the middle of the night. Okay, that's good to know. Um, hey, bro. Right. Give me some lumpy pumpkin here. Fill her up. It gets cool in just five minutes. I mean, I just buy it for storage. I mean, d d when it gets cold, does that mean it won't replenish my health anymore? Okay, let's go. I'll meet you guys, um... Back in Skyloft. Huh. Hey guys, what's up? So I'm back, uh... I'm looking around the place and I can't believe I didn't see this. Over here. I know the graveyard is in Skyloft. Um, I thought... I thought it was in a different place, like... But then... Wait, they said it's in Skyloft, so it's in Skyloft. So it's right here. But, um... They said I have to go there at night, so I wonder if there's any way I can sleep or something. Can I sleep in the wait? Huh. Um, what the heck? Come on, Link. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe I did not see the graveyard. It's so small. I. So, um, this is the school, right? Um, I asked this because, like, do I have to go to my bed or something? Do I have? Don't I have a bed in here? I'm so confused right now. Okay, this is my room. Till night. I'm about to say... He just like... Oh my gosh, Link just like, like, he must have been tired. I don't blame the guy. I do not blame Link for being as tired as he is. Fighting monster after monster and just running around the entire world. He ran in, he ran in some kind of, uh, he ran in a grassy level. He ran, 
Well, he ran through a forest, he ran through a volcano, and now he's gonna have to do more running around. But first, um... Let me see, I know where the volcano is. It should be, like, across near the light tower. What? Did I say volcano? No, I meant just the graveyard. Oh my gosh, I'm messing up. Graveyard. Okay, I'm going the right way. Oh my gosh. It's the little things that, it's the little things that make this game. Whoa! I will slice you. Don't you make me. I'm much stronger than we last met. Nothing happened. It's not about what am I missing? Do I, uh. Is, the, the old man said the monster hit the gravestone and it glowed. Which one? Now I know. It's this one. None, none of them, none of them must close. Okay, so it's this one. Oh, and that opened. Okay then. Dang, that's a long run. Where the heck am I? Don't fall off, Quinn. Don't fall off. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. We're gonna... It's time to go blazing, bro. We're gonna go blazing. We're gonna go blazing. We need to go and fight that thing. Whoa. What is that thing? Dang, that's ugly. Stop! Please, I beg of you, don't hurt me. That was, you know, in the back of my mind, in the back of my mind, I had a feeling that monster was fake. I'm not kidding. Because that doesn't look like the typical monster from Legend of Zelda. Looks like a guy in, the, in costume. Oh, goodness. How... Bad this must look right now, but I assure you, I mean, no how we were just playing a scream as loud as you can game. Uh. Isn't that a fun game? No, it's not. Oh dear, perhaps I should explain this. Somewhere. My name is Beatrix. What? And I am a monster who resides in here. So you are a monster. So okay. I thought this guy was in a costume or something, but since he is a real monster, he's just cowardly, or is afraid of getting stabbed. But please allow me to correct one popular misconcept. When I'm, while I'm certainly a monster, I wouldn't dream of terrorizing people in this town. You see, this adorable little girl is the only one who didn't let loose a blood curling scream at sight of me. Since she began to visit me here, I felt positively jubilant. You see, my heart only wishes to become friends with the lovely people of Skylar. But as you sh surely can imagine, it has proven quite difficult to break dance when you're struck with paralyzed fear at sight of me. I can see that. I was getting ready to slice him. <laughs> I was getting ready to slice him in half. I was like, yeah! I assure you, nothing will fill my heart with joy more than 
to be friends with the fine people of the town, but as soon as I try to approach any of them and extend my claw in friendship, they run and scream as always they seen a walking nightmare. Oh, right, silly me, I've got to hit myself. You see, there's an old tale among my monstrous kin for that ghost falling. Uh -huh. It seems like when humans make other humans happy, the happy humans produces a substance known as gratitude crystal. Mm -hmm. Gratitude crystals are quite amazing. Just look at them and knowing there was such gratitude in the world could turn me from monster into human. Hey. Oh goodness, nothing would delight me more than to become human. From the moment I laid my regrettable demon eyes on you, I could tell you had a gentle and gen generous heart. Okay. Won't you please gather gratitude crystals for me? What the heck are gratitude crystals? I'm tempted to say no, but okay. <laughs> Truly, you've helped me. I've heard that you can obtain gra pure gratitude by helping people solve the trouble. <laughs> they could also be merely lying here in Skyline for us, where among clouds, anywhere you find. Okay. I'm sure someone with a heart as pure as you is able to see them. Put some. <laughs> Any help that you could provide would be dearly appreciated. You. He's not a bad man. He saved me one time when I almost fell over the edge, and he lets me come here and scream as loud as I want to. Anyway, he said it was dangerous to go alone at night, so I just hang out here for a while. Tell my mom I'll come for home in the morning. Awkward, okay. Just awkward, okay? Awkward. Alright. So, I think the only thing to do is to... Uh... Wait, didn't I... Oh, yeah. Up to, 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 up to. This is gonna take long, so I'm... Um, I have to tell the mother... And maybe she'll give me some gratitude crystals because it will make her happy to know her daughter is back home. It will make her happy to know her daughter is safe, I guess, but I'm going to cut it to where it's morning, okay? Uh, if I can find my way home, where's my house? No, where's the, yeah, the night academy. Okay, all right. Alright, to save me any more embarrassment... Bro. Ow. You little... I know I was supposed to cut it. Normally, I love animals, but this is appalling. Away with you. Don't worry, he's safe. I was supposed to cut it already, but I'm sorry, I just couldn't get myself to cut the scene. Okay, now I'm gonna cut it, so uh, I'll see you guys back at the Night Academy, okay? Okay, I cut it back to the Night Academy, and I just literally walked by a plant accidentally. I got a gratitude crystal. These form when, when a person is so overwhelmed with feelings of thankfulness, crystal gratitude, okay? Collect these insurance. So, do I give it to him? Okay, let me, uh, let me just take the short path right here. And just go to sleep and tell the mother just so I can get... She probably has some gratitude crystals, so... Okay, so to speed this up, I'm just gonna cut it to where we go to the statue of the goddess. Oh, so I made it back up here, and it seems like the mother is not here. I thought I was—I thought I was instructed to tell her that. Okay. Uh, well, um. Hey, it doesn't matter anyway. So, I'm gonna stop here. Um, I'm gonna stop here, so I'm gonna save and quit. Because, um, we are elapsing the maximum time. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We got a good boss fight, we got a good boss fight out of it. And, um, we got some kind of... 
we got some, we did a side mission, so that's good. So thank you guys so very much for watching. Um, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you got, if you prefer more um, of the. <laughs> If you prefer a lot of more videos, if you'd like to see more videos from me, uh, please smash that subscribe button. I would love for you guys to join the Quiniverse family. We're going to do a lot of streams and a lot of recordings as time goes on. And since it's a brand new year of 2022, we are going to do a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of recording and a lot of streams. So, I um, just wanted to tell you guys one announcement. Um... I'm going to be, uh, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to be streaming in like two weeks. So what I'm going to do is, um, I'm picking a stream date for myself. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to stream around, uh, next Saturday maybe? Or this Saturday, I'm not sure. But, um, I will figure out something. So, you know what, um, how about this? Okay, so, um... I'm going to be streaming um, this weekend, or at least I'll try to be. It'll be this Saturday, which is... Uh... Sorry, I'm just trying to kind of uh, teach myself. I'll be streaming this Saturday, which is on January 8th. And hopefully you guys can catch my video there. I'll be streaming... I'll, I'll be streaming Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. I'm going to be playing that game for the first time on a PS5. So, I'll be looking forward to that as much as I can. I'll be streaming for like an hour or two, just to see what the game is like. So, hopefully we can uh, do a lot of things for that game. So, like I said, if you guys like to hit the subscribe button, please click the top of my head. Or please click the subscribe button below the video. And, if you guys love to look at some of the past videos, look to my uh, right, I guess. And you'll see a lot of my videos, um, including my previous Including my current gameplay. I gotta work on my commentary. So if you look to the right of me, you'll see my current gameplays, which is not only Skyward Sword, but Metroid Dread and Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. So we're gonna continue those. So thank you guys so very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.